fact, actually, I, I didn't really even hear God say that. I just happened to just start encouraging her and saying, hey, I love you. You're awesome. Thank you for helping me. She's been a big supporter in my life. And then after that, I, I just happened to write, I said, and by the way, you're absolutely gorgeous. And then after I said that, I heard the Holy Spirit say, change it to beautiful. So I changed it from gorgeous to beautiful, and I just sent the text and didn't think anything of it. And I just thought, man, all right, God, just encourage her. She texted me back, and she said, wow, Britt. She said, I am so amazed right now. She said, because when I woke up this morning, I was spending time with God. She said, there's been a lot of things on my heart, a lot of things I've been praying for, and I just haven't known if God was really listening and if he was really there. She said, so this is what I said to God. I said, God, if you're real, and if you're really listening to me, then have one person today tell me that I am beautiful. And I said, well, and then I texted her back and I said, well, you're going to think this is crazy. I said, because I actually wrote out gorgeous. And I heard the Holy Spirit say, change it to beautiful. Is it not amazing to you that the creator of the universe, he knew my friend. He knew everything she needed. That, that's crazy to me. It ministered to me. Because I was like, man, God, if you're listening to every one of her prayers, then you're listening to every one of mine. And you are so real. And he's listening to every single one of your prayers tonight. And I want that to encourage you, as me and Will said, that God is real. That he hears the cries of your heart. Do you believe that tonight? Woo! Maybe you're struggling with that. And we believe that by the end of the night, you're going to receive a touch from God. You're going to receive... A touch from the Holy Spirit, you're going to have an encounter with God and know that He is real. I'll tell you later about the day that I met God, but, but quickly I'll tell you about it now. As far as, it was a real encounter. I felt His presence come into my room. And I knew that God was real. People ask me, they say, how do you believe in God? And, and you know, I think there's a reason we're talking a lot about this tonight. Because even as we were praying, my brother was praying and he said, God, if there's anyone here tonight that just doesn't believe in you, God, shift their mind, shift their heart to where they will believe in you. And I believe that God is doing that even now. And I believe that you're going to have a real encounter with him tonight. He's going to meet you face to face. Come on, do you believe it? Yeah. You know, there's been a couple times where I feel like God has spoke to me. And one time was when I was 17 years old.